The parties agreed to implement salary increases based on TransNamib salary structure. This means a 5% salary increase for the A1 to A3 level, a 4,5% increase for levels B1 to B5, and a 3,5% increase for levels C1 to C5. Workers will also receive a $100 increase on transport allowances, which translates into a $542 to $642 per month for all members in the bargaining unit. Transnamib said in the spirit of goodwill, it will not apply the no work, no pay principle as previously planned. Natao, on its part, has waived 22 months of back pay and workers will only receive three months back pay. The two parties have also agreed to meet at least once a month to improve the relationship between the management and workers. And also, the parties have agreed to jointly work together to increase the company's income from the current levels of an average of $45 million per month by the beginning of the next financial period.